Dalton Trumbo was many things, as we discussed a little bit in the lobby. I mean, he was uh, an iconoclast, a radical, a charmer, a great sense of humor. But, but I got the sense in watching the film that uh, the thing that really came out in him was his passion for writing, his passion for the word and the story. No matter what context he was put in, he, had, he was driven to write. And I was wondering if in your research in, 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 uh, for the film, if there was any, any scripts or movies or any of his books or passages that really stuck out for you, in particular about his writing. There's a, 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 he was a tremendously uh, ambitious and, uh, and prolific. He wrote constantly, um, to a detriment, I think. To, to, uh, he became so myopic at times that he, as we saw, he would smoke too much and drink too much and just shove food down his throat and he didn't sleep well and, and all those things that come as a condition of, uh, like, a, a, like an addiction to, to that craft. And um, he, he was uh, an a, a anarchist in some ways. He was uh, uh, a nonconformist, certainly. He, he was... Uh, he was very prolific also in just in, in his daily life. So um, if he saw something was unjust or even stupid uh, or disliked the idea of uh, the electric company raising the, his bill, he would write a letter. It, uh, so to, to most of us who say, you know, someone should do something about that. Well, he was the type of guy to actually do the something and he wrote copious amounts of letters to a variety of different people and and certainly his personality came out in that and he but even in a complaint he always always wanted to appear um, intelligent and win the argument um, in his movies uh, you'll see it just a variety of a life um, romance and whimsy and in, in Roman holiday you'll see a patriotism in 30 seconds over Tokyo um, uh, and a man called Joe, uh, there is uh, certainly um, Johnny Got His Gun is a, is a, a beautifully uh, written uh, anti-war uh, novel, and he later directed that as a film. Um, Spartacus was his, his call th that was very, um, very much in tune with his belief system. Um, Spartacus seemed to fit the, the time, the time uh, as as the blacklist was coming to an end, and that that film hastened it, you know, some, and and it also fit the man. I mean, so yeah, it did. Uh, yeah, and he wasn't through. So years later, he wrote Papillon, mm -hmm. and Papillon was all about that too, where the the guard says to Steve McQueen, "Just tell us who gave you the water, mm -hmm. right. gave you the food, and we'll let you out." 